हेलो दोस्तों हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू गैज आर गुड सो दोस्तों टू डू टॉपिक स्टार्ट विद वर्चुअल मशीन सो वट इज वर्चुअल मशीन तो अ वर्चुअल मशीन इज अ सॉफ्टवेयर दैट अलाउज अस टू इंस्टॉल एंड यूज अदर ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम लाइक विंडोज लिनक्स एंड डेवियन राइट एंड सेमल्टेनेशनल ऑन आवर मशीन द ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम इन विच वर्चुअल मशीन रन आर कॉल्ड वर्चुअलाइज ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम सो वी अंडरस्टैंड अ रियल वर्ल्ड एग्जाम्पल ऑफ अ वर्चुअल मशीन लाइक मशीन इज अ रनिंग विंडोज लाइक अ वर्चुअल मशीन इट इज रनिंग ऑन द विंडो ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम ऑन अ मैक कंप्यूटर ओके सो बाय यूजिंग अ वर्चुअल मशीन सॉफ्टवेयर लाइक पैरल ऑफ वर्चुअल बॉक्स अ यूजर कैन क्रिएट अ वर्चुअल विंडोज मशीन ऑन देयर मैक कंप्यूटर ओके अलाउंग देम टू रन विंडोज वनली एप्लीकेशन or uh, uh, software that is not available on mac okay so the virtual machine runs as a separate environment within the mac operating system allowing the users to switch back and uh, forth between the two operating system as needed so i hope you cleared what is virtual machine and yeah dosto i have already covered this topic in a docker like why docker what is docker advantages of docker disadvantages of docker i have already covered this topic so if you not see the uh, lecture so please see and next topic is our container versus virtual machine right so like uh, what is container i have already told in next video like what is container right so uh, there is uh, basically container versus virtual machine so what is container integration in a container is faster and cheap okay and in virtual machine integration in virtual and costly no vestige of memory and vestige of memory right and it uses the same kernel but different distribution right and virtual machine it uses multiple independent operating system so basically as a devops engineer we know that container versus virtual uh, virtual machine right like what is virtual machine and what is container what is the difference in both like what is container and what is virtual machine so i hope that is clear what is container and what is virtual machine right so next is docker features so what is docker feature right what are features so although docker provides a lots of feature we are listening uh, listing some major features which are given below okay so first uh, like easy and faster configuration so this is a key feature of a docker that help us configure the system easier and faster okay we can deploy our code in less time and effort okay so this is clear so next is application isolation so what is application isolation it provides container that that are used to run application in an isolation environment okay each in each container is independent of another and allow us to execute any kind of application so there is one word isolation environment so what is application isolation what is isolation right so basically an isolation environments refer to a way of running application where they are separated from other application okay and uh, running on the same host machine in the context of a docker containers provide a high level of isolation between different application running on the same host so it simply means that uh, each container runs as a separate environment with its own file system networking and resources okay and uh, is isolated from other containers running on the same host so uh, basically this helps to ensure that uh, if containers fail or crash Uh, whatever so it does uh, so it does not uh, affect the other containers running on the same host so this is the simple meaning of isolation environment so i hope this is clear to everyone what is isolation environment and what is application isolation okay so next is docker swarm it is a clustering and scheduling tool for docker containers okay so i'll make a full video on docker swarm so don't worry and for now let's just understand what is docker swarm so basically docker swarm is a clustering of nodes right basically clustering of nodes so what is nodes nodes is basically your server next is services so what is services service uh, service is like of task that lets us specify the state of the container inside a cluster okay i read this but we understand a real world example right 
So like if you have a web application that uh, consists of a front end and back end. Okay. And uh, you can create two services. One for the front end containers and another for the back end containers. The Docker Swarm scheduler will ensure that the containers are distributed across the cluster in a way. Okay. So that maximize resources utilization and high availability. Right. And uh, this allows the web application to handle a large number of requests it will ensure that uh, it remains available and even and if one or more containers fail like in one word uh, like just docker service is a way to define how to containers should run in a production environment and how it should be scaled across multiple nodes in a cluster okay so i hope this is clear what is services next is what is docker daemon so what is docker daemon so i read this docker daemon runs on the host operating system System. It is responsible for running containers to manage Docker services, uh, Docker daemon communication with other daemons. So, firstly, uh, we understand what is Docker daemon. Docker daemon is nothing. Docker daemon is basically your Docker engine. So here one uh, word like host operating system so what is that like what is host operating system so the host operating system is the primary operating system running on a computer or a server okay basically it is the operating system that manages the computer's hardware resources such as the cpu memory and storage provide uh, a platform and uh, for other uh, software application okay to run on top of it and basically the host operating system is the operating system on which the docker daemon is running and uh, it is responsible for managing the containers and their resources okay so i hope this is clear what is docker daemon what is host operating system and everything is clear i hope so if you like the video then share it anywhere where you want and please subscribe my channel and so let Let's meet again tomorrow with a new video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care, friends.